What is up everybody, this is your host Subasai, and this review is just going to be really short, so, but anyway, I watched the movie Big Hero 6. Now, it is an animated movie, and that, I'll make my way through some of Disney's animated movies. It came out in 2014 and that. So anyway, I enjoyed the movie. And yeah, it was, it just, it's sort of like, after seeing so many different movies, like, Inside Out, Frozen, Zootopia, Ralph Breaks the Internet, and then this, it's like, man, no two movies, like, they're, they're all different, they're all unique in their own way, it's like, it's, you can't really compare them, in a sense, like, they're just, they're so different, they're so abstract and so unique in their own ways and that, so anyway, I enjoyed the movie, it was, yeah, I'm just trying to think, sort of, I don't know, it was sort of just like a very traditional movie vibe. I don't know. Anyway, I liked the, I thought it was really cool how they did all the the superpowers and that, with the, all the, the unique things, and how they had, like, one of them had the, you know, all the, like, the different bubbles that did different stuff, and then one of them had the razor blades, and one of them had the shield thing, so it went like that, and I thought it was really cool how they, they did use that kind of technology and that, I thought they were cool, cool wee powers that they came up with, the, and, you know, the programming of the, the big hero, I thought that was, it was, like, it was cool just, like, seeing the do 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 and upgrades and that, and, you know, the plot twists and that, I thought, I thought it was well done, I thought it was well done, yeah, it, 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 the, the guy reminded me of the guy from How to Train a Dragon, you know, the same main character in that, it was, yeah, I don't know, it was, it was a solidly enjoyable movie. I don't really know what to say about it. I don't know why. I don't really know why. It's just, it's just sort of like the movie just sort of, that, that was enjoyable. And that, uh, interesting, I did read on the Wikipedia that in South Korea, they just called it Big Hero to avoid confusion about people thinking there was a sequel. And I was like, ah, that's clever. Because literally, when I went to, when I was meant to watch it, I'm like, Big Hero 6, I'm like, is there a Big Hero 5, 4, 3, 2, or 1? I'm like, you know, am I late to the party? Like, with Fast and Furious and that. So I, even I was sort of like, like thinking, oh, have I missed some of the other ones? I was like, no, 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 it's that. But yeah, anyway, I thought it was interesting how they've done that. Man, it's like only been two minutes. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I, I don't really, I don't really know what to say. I don't know. It, it's sort of like, Nothing really stood out or struck me or anything. But that said, it was still a great movie. It didn't have to have anything massively, like, stick out and be super different in that. It was still just really enjoyable. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. Because I was like, I, have I even got enough content to make this review about it? I don't, I don't really much to say about it. I just enjoyed it. But I can't really pinpoint why? Like, you know, I can't really say, oh, it's because of that, it was definitely because of that, it was just like, it's just enjoyable. But yeah, anyway, so, because there was, there's certain ones that I feel like have massive lasting effects more so than other ones in that. Like, for example, there's so much sort of, even t in, you know, 20, uh, another thing interesting, the, they didn't release the 4K Blu-ray, uh, yeah, t of Big Hero, the Big Hero 6, until, like, I think it was November 2019, it's like, that's so late, like, I mean, that's years afterwards, like, I mean, that's pretty recent, it's like, oh, it's actually, like, just kind of come out, you know, just in the last few months, and it's like, what, like, I just find that amazing, it's like, that's so late, how do they, like, is there a reason why they took that long, like, I don't know, like, they, they couldn't really, could they re-render it in that? I don't know how they do that, like, uh, how, you know, how do they just create that now, like, hasn't, either it was, they created the film in that kind of depth quality, or they hadn't, I don't know, anyway, and they, they had this, this thing where they have five petabytes worth of data, and still, like, all that movie assets and that, of, like, heaps of their movies and that, Disney movies and that, so, anyway, it was cool reading it, like, how they, like, they sort of looked, at one of them, like, briefly looked through a few of the comics, and the other one didn't even read the comics and that, and yeah, it was it was it was again different and unique, in its own way. In that, uh, what was I going to mention? Oh yeah, yeah, L like long lasting fix. Because I remember seeing the the board up like years ago. Because well, yeah, probably like early 2015. I seen the boards up at the movies. And that I don't know what movies I did watch then. I didn't really watch that many movies at the movie theaters. But yeah, because yeah, some things have much lot long lasting effects. Most things, most mo most movies sort of just come and go, and that you know. But uh, you know, Frozen obviously lasted 
Like, you know, you still hear sort of Frozen related things or themes or whatnot. You know, is there's not really, not really like sort of, uh, there's no, I don't know. I haven't come across like memes about it. I'm sure there, are, of course, will be memes in that, but not sort of on a, re there's no, but I, again, I don't know of any Frozen memes in that, but it doesn't feel like it's sort of been as, had as, as a long lasting effect. And that's just an observation. It's not a criticism of it. The vast majority of films, movies, everything doesn't have mass long lasting effects, you know, like to this, to the extent that like the Lion King or Frozen does and that. But yeah, anyway, nevertheless, I still thought it was a good movie and I enjoyed it. And yeah, that's going to wrap up this review. I said I'd keep it short. And if I keep talking, it will be like another two minutes or whatnot. But yeah, anyway, good movie, solid movie. Yeah. I had frozen berries and then some chips which I found. They were very tasty. The copper kettle chips barbecue flavor. Thank you, Mum, for those. And then I had some more frozen berries afterwards. So yeah, anyway, have a wonderful, beautiful rest of your day. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. See you all next time. Bye for now.